Today, I'm gonna be tricking my girlfriend by convincing her that she was in a coma. We've been trying to dig you up for so long. I'm so happy that you're here. I'm gonna send a video to your mom right now. She's very concerned. No, 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 no. Lay down, lay down, lay down. Why? No, Bells, it's your boy Bills back in again with another YouTube video. Today I'm gonna be attempting to pull off one of the hardest pranks ever. Today I'm gonna be tricking my girlfriend by convincing her that she was in a coma. Ah! I know exactly what you guys are thinking. It's definitely not gonna be easy to pull this off, but I have a few things that I think will make this go down perfectly. So first things first is we're gonna be changing the date on her phone so it literally looks like she's in the future. So when she wakes up, she's gonna be very confused. But not only that, I actually have my brace for when I actually got my plastic surgery and I'm gonna be using that to make it look like she got that from the doctor and I need to put it on her. But overall, when I wake her up, I'm just gonna be super excited to see her and convince her that she's literally been been asleep in a coma for over two weeks. So if you guys don't know, Lauren and I actually do not live together, but we constantly have sleepovers all the time, and tonight is one of those nights. And she's gonna have no idea that tomorrow morning I'm gonna be pranking her. But before we get started with this prank, make sure you guys subscribe down below, tap the bell, and follow me on Instagram. Come back here and comment the word done in your Instagram username so you guys have the chance to win a brand new iPhone 11 X Max Pro. And while you're at it, make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up and send me proof of the thumbs up in my Instagram DM so you guys have the chance to win $100. And last week's 100 like a winner goes to Bethany Kimbo. Thank you so much, Bethany Kimbo, for killing in the Team Bells community and liking last week's YouTube video and sending me proof in the Instagram DM. Yeah. I'm praying that I can pull up this prank, but let's pack up all my stuff in the tent to Lauren. Okay, so your boy got all the essentials for tonight's sleepover, including some of this stuff for the prank. Shh, don't say anything. But it's getting really late, so let's head to Lauren's. Let's go. Oh my god, that was so scary jumping in here, but we just made it to Lauren's apartment. We're in the elevator right now. You guys, it is getting so late. You guys, look at this. No, don't close on me. 1014, it took forever to get here. As you already know, I was blasting just leaving the car because you already know the beebs is everything. Mm, I kind of feel a little bit bad because Lauren and I have been trying to go to bed at a normal, reasonable time, but yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. As you guys know, it's 10 o'clock now and I'm just now getting to Lauren's apartment, so she's not gonna be too happy. We're gonna be up pretty late and probably be tired tomorrow. Okay, so I just took off all my makeup right now. I'm trying not to let Lauren know that I'm filming. I don't want her to know that I'm doing a vlog at all, so I haven't even like really put her in the video or anything, but I'm like getting ready for bed, and then we're gonna get on with you know what, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, you guys, it takes for it's so hard to get all my makeup off. It's like I just don't want to sleep hey. with my makeup on. Huh? Who are you talking to? No one. I Myself. Okay. Are you you know, sure? <laughs> yeah, I do that sometimes. This is gonna be really, really difficult to even like make this work because like, yeah, but I feel like she's gonna be in such a daze when she wakes up that she's gonna be so confused and if I make it like so, if I make it so like serious and spot on that I'm like just, like consoling her and being like so surprised that she's like, wo like just woke up for the first time in two weeks, I feel like it's gonna work. But anyways, last night I put in ice packs in the freezer, so I'm gonna be using these to wake Lauren up. And you already know, I'm gonna have the brace next to her. I'm gonna try to see if I can get it to put on her head to be like, oh my gosh, the doctor said put this on your head. And all that, but I'm gonna go take Lauren's phone right now and I'm gonna change the date and make it look like we're two weeks in the future. So Lauren's sleeping, I have to be really quiet. That's why I put this chair right here. Where is her phone? Oh my gosh. 
watch it, guys. Oh yeah, let's run. You guys, Lauren is such a deep sleeper. It is currently almost 11 o'clock, you guys. She's really sleeping in today. All right. Okay, so we're gonna be going into her settings. I've never even done this, you guys. I just know you can do it. Date and time. Boom. So we're gonna be changing the time to, let's say that she skipped our playlist flight and missed all of playlist. Wednesday, March 4th. Holy moly, she's gonna flip out. Oh, you guys can see the date. Literally Wednesday, March 4th. We're in the future now. Yo, I just changed into the orange hoodie because I just realized that if we're almost two weeks in the future, I clearly would not be wearing the same hoodie that I wore last night. So, <laughs> all right, it's game time now. Let's get Lauren. Team Bills, let's go. Miracle. What are you talking about? Wait, you're, you're awake. What are you talking oh my god. about? Oh my god, baby, you're awake. What time is baby, it? Calm down. What time is it? It's 11.08. You, Why are you talking I, I actually about can't believe you're awake right now. Oh my god, baby. I can't believe it either. Why? You've been in a coma for almost two weeks. What? Two weeks, are baby. You Please put this on your head. Your head. You don't remember? You felt up. You don't remember anything? No. I fell off. What are you talking about? Literally, you fell down the stairs like two weeks ago. You've been in a coma for two weeks, and the doctors couldn't get you. Couldn't couldn't do anything to get you awake. What? Your mom came back. You were in the hospital for my eight mom, days. My mom Babe, came re back. Relax. Don't that on me. Relax. You had a like your head a concussion. You fell down the stairs and hit your head really hard. What doctor? Dr. George. Why am I in my bed right now then? Because we couldn't do anything. Like it was really expensive and we couldn't do anything and they wanted me to like watch out for you and be here at home. What? Babe. You're putting that I don't Babe. get that. No! Don't keep put it on that. your head. I have no, to keep an eye out on you. Your mom had to leave back home because she couldn't be out here for that long. She had things going on. And she, it was becoming so late that you weren't like waking up. Like it was went on for so, so she long. So she left me. Yeah. The, what? The, your mom's literally calling right now. Where's she's been my, she's been calling me like crazy, trying to get it, trying to get phone? updates. Where's my phone? Why does it say? Literally, look at the date, babe. We missed playlists, your flight, everything. We had no. to cancel everything. You've been asleep for two weeks. No, it says March. No, it's it's been, March. My, Playlist was back last no. month at the end of the month. No, my birthday's tomorrow. No, your birthday is not tomorrow. Yeah. You're, you missed your birthday. Everything. What? You literally fell down the stairs. Babe, the dog, I, we need to put this box on your head. No, no, no. Hey, Stop. He said you, you have to I have feel, this on for a certain amount of time. Fine. Every couple, a few hours every single day. I feel fine. Are you sure? You don't feel pain at all your head. You hit your head so hard. Babe, don't move too much. How is my dog under here? Because I put him under there to console you. We've been trying to get you up for so long. I'm so happy that you're here, baby. Don't get that out. It's cold. Relax. It's cold. Relax. Where's the doctor? My head hurts. You left the doctor's office like six days ago. Because six there's, days ago? Yeah, they just said like I certain thought... precautions to take and just to keep an eye out for you because they literally thought you were going to be stuck like this for a long time. You can't be stuck at the hospital, it's super, super expensive. I thought... And the insurance doesn't cover. I thought that, like... Here, hold on to this nice pack. It's cold. And make sure that you, like, your body knows that you can feel things now because you couldn't feel, like, you weren't responding to anything. I thought... Do so you feel that? It feels cold, right? I thought yesterday we went to, like, the store and then we came back yesterday here. Yesterday I was literally watching you, watching movies the entire time, trying to get you to get even away. Babe, you were literally gone. Like, it's like that. Like, I, we thought you died, but your heart was still beating. It's okay to not remember anything. You don't need to remember anything. Like, it was. How many the doctor people? said you're not going to remember anything. So. How many people know? Everyone. Oh Even your social media. I need to check here, my Instagram. Here, wait. Let's. Here, let me just get your phone and let everyone know. Where's my phone? I don't know. 
What's your on my phone? Are you serious? Wait, you want to me? I'm sad. I'm Baby, sad. guys, Lauren's finally awake. She finally woke up. Say hi. It's okay. It's all right. She's finally awake. No, 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 lay down, lay down, lay down. Why? No, you can't, you can't get up right now. I don't know Why? if it's okay. I need to contact the doctor. I'm perfectly capable. I don't know if it's okay, though. You've been laying down. You haven't walked on your feet in so long. I don't know. I'm going to send a video to your mom right now. I, I, she's very concerned. She literally, like, left, like, a few days ago. She's so Why concerned. She I have no idea because she had things going on and like she had to take care I of things and she could going on. I know but she had to go down. back home and I was the only one to, to look out for you because she thought you were gonna be like this for the rest of your life. So she just went. I need this I'm gonna send her a video right now, okay? Oh oh my gosh! Mom what She's fine she woke up! What oh my mean? god! I'm gonna send that to her right now. Are you sure we didn't like I can't believe Starbucks this yesterday? No! We well, haven't done anything in so long. No. Look at the date. Please look at the date right now. I did. I I I'm texting her right now saying she were finally awake. I that's right. Oh my god. I'm seeing the video. Because if you had so much ice packs, are you sure you're okay? You don't feel nauseous at all? Oh, this blanket smells like dog pee. I was so confused. I really think you should put this on. The doctor really said that you need to put this. I've been putting this on your head every, for a little bit. Every single day, you need to. Are you sure you don't feel like bad at all? I hurt a little now. Do you need an Ow. 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 I think we should contact the doctor to the doctors right now. Is no, your... apparently the doctor comes to you and says I'm in bed. Oh, no! I told you we left the doctors a couple days ago. You were there for eight days, but I'm wondering if we need to take you back to the doctors because he's he recommended that he said if anything happens, let me know, call me before you do anything. And I don't know if it's okay for you to walk. I don't know if it's okay for you to walk, baby. I think I'm gonna call the doctor right now. I can't find the number to the doctor. Oh my god, what if you can't walk anymore? I can't walk, are you serious? Baby, I don't know what to do. I can't find the number to the doctor. I was literally walking like, it oh my god, felt oh my god, oh my like god. yesterday, apparently it was 16 days ago. I can't find the number to the doctor and I'm freaking out, what if you can't walk? You can't find the number to the doctor, but I was there for 16 days, that's oh some bad god. service. Oh. Baby, you were in a coma, and I just have to let you know that this is a prank, and you're not actually gonna go away. And I look like a stupid. <laughs> no. Did I scare you at all? Did you feel like you're in a coma yes. at all? Yes, you literally oh, got me. I'm so sorry. Oh. Was I was trying to get. How is it March fourth? Then it's really not. Look at the date. It's actually February twentieth, and I just. Oh my god. I didn't know you can change the date on your phone, but I actually changed the date on your phone. So my birthday is tomorrow. Yes, your birthday is still tomorrow. And you did not miss your birthday. You didn't fall down the stairs. Playlist, it was all pranks. You didn't miss playlists. Everything's good. And you're alive. And you're alive. Say hi to the camera. You got pranked by Team Bales. <laughs> you actually got me, but I'm going to get you. So. No, you're not. You literally can't get me. Like, stop. This is the first time you actually like, did not, like, be in on the prank. Like, I feel like you always mess up my pranks. I know. You ruin it, and I finally got you for once, and I got you good. I just, I just woke up, so, like, yeah, I'm gonna fall for it. Okay, but you didn't even know I was vlogging. That's the funniest part, is usually when I do these pranks, you guys, like, I come over with the camera. This time, I hid the camera. I made sure that you had no idea that I was even doing a video with you guys. I've been doing this so discreetly. And I finally got you. Okay, that was definitely one of the hardest pranks to pull off. On the bright side, I feel like my prank was a success considering the fact that it didn't backfire on me for once. You guys know what time it is. It is now time to announce the weekly subscriber shout out. And this week's weekly subscriber shout out goes to Malaya Fisher. Thank you so much to Malaya Fisher for killing it in the Team Bells community. Always liking, commenting, and subscribing. You are so amazing, Malaya, and I love you so very much, and I want you all to go show love to her. But you guys know what time it is. It is now time for me to go but before I go I want to remind you guys one last time to subscribe down below tap the bell and follow me on Instagram 
come back here, make sure you guys comment the word done in your Instagram username so you guys have the chance to win a brand new iPhone 11 Max Pro. And don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up so you guys have the chance to win $100 in next week's YouTube video. Well, unfortunately, it's my time to go, but I love you all so very much, and I'll see you guys next Sunday. Mwah.